Alright guys, we are into game three of our fresh account, playing support to Diamond. So far, not good games. First game we had an AFK level level at like five minutes and we lost. I didn't even upload that one. And then second game we lost. It was really unfortunate. We actually were, it was a close game, but we still lost. I think uh, going Electrocute will definitely help me in lane. Uh, I, I've been going Conquer, but I feel like the problem with Conquer is I'm always under leveled, so I can never really utilize it. And then in lane, the fights are too quick to you know stack my Conquer up. So this game, I'm trying Electrocute to see if it'll help us with laning phase, and as a result, help me in the mid game. But no promises. I'm actually gonna I'm gonna hold my I'm gonna hold my stacks for next wave on the melee minions, so we can get level two. <clears throat> if I hold it for the next wave, it's better. Melee minions take longer to kill. Maybe we can get a quick level 2. There we go. Right. Help her push. Okay. Well, they conceded. Early game, it looks like they don't want to. They don't want to fuck with us. At least this time, I have a Kaisa, who's a little bit better in lane than Ash, or maybe not better in lane, but just better in general. I feel more, way more damage. Um, I want cannon, so I'm gonna hold my stack again. I hate warding, but I'm gonna make sure that we don't get early ganked by Kha'Zix. Okay, I'm, I kind of want to let them push here. So I'm going to wait till the cannon's one shot. Okay, nice. Nice. It's going to start pushing on us now. Kha'Zix is top side. So at level three, maybe we make a play. They're going to start pushing soon. I'm, I'm waiting for my opportunity here. I kind of want them to engage. Okay, we got level three now. We can fight. If I land a Q on Zaya, I go. They know I'm in here. Kaisa seems like she wants to play really safe in this lane. She, oh, she's going for a ward. That's fine. Our Hecarim is it's warded there, though, so don't walk up. Come through lane. Gotta love the passive early game, though. Okay. I mean, it's fine, I guess. Okay, they ignited me, so. Two points into W for me? Okay. Couldn't follow up with that Q because I didn't have enough energy. But we honestly, we, we won that 3v3. Okay, Hecarim's going to invade. I got a stack. I'm gonna use my W to lifesteal here. Definitely helps. He's backing off. Okay, I guess we just reset. Yeah, we take a reset here. I'm gonna go double longsword. Double Longsword is good for early game. Whoa. You just took like eight tower shots, and now you kept the back. Kai's just still in lane. Uh, I don't think it's worth roaming here. Let's just go back bot. I put two points into W. I might max W. It's good for assisting my ADC. 
but... Oops, I did not mean to fucking do that. They're playing so safe. I think I do have to roam this game. I knew he had jump, but like the fact that he hadn't used it yet made me think he didn't have it, and it just fucked me up. Kaisa should have recalled, I feel. But we can double gank this now. Uh, two points in a Q or keep maxing W. There I go. Three points in a, in a W. Shove this in. Okay, now she probably wants to back, right? Nope, she wants plates. Okay. We take plates then. I guess we I guess we're clear to get two plates. Okay, nope, she wants to back. Alright, I back with you. Except the problem is is with the wave on her tower, it's gonna freeze. At least the second wave hits, so it might not freeze. It might break the freeze. All right, what are we building here? Are we going Eclipse or are we going Gore Drinker? We need a Gore Drinker. I don't know what I'm going to build, but I am definitely going to get an early Ruby Crystal. I... Going Eclipse for Sida makes me a little too squishy as a support. As a jungle, it's okay because I'm up in level usually, but as a support, I think... Maybe we need to rearrange the way we play the early game. I don't know if Eclipse is the play. If, now, if we were like stomping this lane, it'd be different, but we're not. It's even. How's our team doing? Eh, Teemo's getting shit on. That's just kind of typical. I really is just. She just shits on everyone in lane. At level 6, I think we actually can win. Actually, I don't want to take cannon yet, because it's going to make it shove too fast. I don't think it's worth insecting, because she just hits R and gets away. They're playing so passive, man. Man, this is a boring lane, dude. They're playing so far back. Okay. Do we look for a play here? Do we look for a play here? I don't know. Okay, it worked. Okay, nice. That's big. Take that. <laughs> oh, you dirty with it, he says. Alright, we're winning. Let's put two points in a queue. Nice, our team's starting to win too. Oh, fuck man. Oh, I'm dead for that. Sick! That's what I get for trying to help Kaisa. Uh, I'm gonna rush Steel Caps this game. Since they have pretty much, other than Ari, they're full AD, so this guy's dead as fuck. Wait, oh. For a second there, I thought he was gonna get out. 
Oh, I forgot to get my oracles. Fuck. There we go. Alright. I think we roam now. I have all. Oh, they're on dragon. It's not worth contesting, I don't think. Uh, okay, good dodge. I don't want them to know that it's me. I'm gonna help him. I'm gonna help them use this Rift Herald. Okay, not bad. Not bad. Not bad. Okay, let's go back bot. Back to the bot lane we go. Fucking pinks everywhere, but I really don't feel like cleaning those right now. I want to help Kai Sun Lane ASAP. Okay, well, if she's gonna freeze, and I guess we can go clear this vision finally. Hecarim's doing it too. Let's put a word there. Let's grab this pink. Cigar. I don't know where Kha'Zix is, but I'm gonna risk it here. Even if he comes, we honestly might be able to beat him. We have steel caps. Okay, Kha'Zix is mid. We're good to go. Kha'Zix is about to be an upset. He's about to be upset -y spaghetti, man. He doesn't have a blue buff. Kha'Zix is here. I honestly think we can take a fight here. Ah, oh, he fucking. I thought he was gonna sit in a brush. Yeah, Kha'Zix is obviously here. That's gonna be a GG right there. Now we just have to deal with the Fed Aurelia. This lane's over. Nice. I got the assist without stealing it. It's actually perfect. Okay, they're getting tower. Uh, I'll take the Skronk. Dude, this is just my jungle instinct right here. It's probably not the smartest to be like killing jungle camps, but I mean, I feel like it's doing me some good. We're, we're also denying Kha'Zix when we take it. She might, she's gonna have to turn and she actually might win. We got 2k gold. Um, yeah, I'm gonna try Gore Drinker out this game. I haven't, tr I haven't tried it on support yet, but it, it might be good. I obviously fucked up that play on Irelia, but I was trying to W the Hecarim, and he, he was out of my range, and he didn't understand that like if he walked over the, right here, I could have W'd and saved him. He was like expecting me to like. I don't know. I guess I could have flashed, but I didn't think I needed to. I'm following Kaisa at this point. Okay. Well, we got some decent vision here. We have bot lane tower dead. We should rotate mid, but 
Ooh, I already got all of my... I already got my support item completely upgraded. That's pretty big. Uh, let's get this dragon. Dragon is free here. Ooh. I don't know about this one. Nice, nice, nice. Two dragon. Oh, no, they got the first dragon. I guess I'm going to rotate for the Aurelia. Oh, wait. Oh, I shouldn't have exhausted or ignited. That was dumb. Uh, I could have one for one, maybe. I don't know what my damage is like the with this item, with these items. That's why I didn't. I didn't take the Lee Syndrome there. Oh, they got her, nice. Or I think they got her. Not before she kills the Teemo, though. Classic. All right, we got Gore Drinker. Let's go grab that. Yeah, I don't know. I definitely want to I definitely want to try other supports out. Like supports that have a little bit more poke and lane. Lee Sung's more of an all-in type champ. It'd be kind of fun to play like the support like the, you know, the poke support role. I've always had fun doing that like when I play with Rav. Just really wanted to get a dub to start the series off on the Lee. And then we, from there, we can go wherever we want, but... Jesus. And it's like, the, I don't know. I think it's the fact that I'm three levels down. Four on I really uh, I can't win this. I don't know what you're doing. We're all gonna die. This really is too fed. Ooh, okay. <gasps> that hit me! Oh, that hit me, bro. No way that hit me. Fuck me. Ah, I'm so bad. I should have fucking killed that Kha'Zix. I should have honestly blast cone queued for the energy refund. I just thought that blast coning might end up fucking me. But I think if I blast cone to get my energy back so I can follow up with Q, I at least get a one for one before dying. Our team's doing solid though, so it doesn't matter. There I really is really the only problem, and we just killed her 2v with 2v1, so. If me and Kaisa can kite her out and kill her, I think uh, I think we'll be fine. Still under leveled, considering I'm a support though, I think we're doing good. It's the one gripe I have with support is just how under leveled you get. But they at least made it so you can get gold in this season, even if you don't have a lot of farm. Shit, she's dead. Oh, nice dodge. Okay, well, I have to flash. We gotta stop focusing on Aurelia. Like, what do people not understand that Aurelia, she might not be a tank, but you, she, she, she's just as tanky as a tank, at least at this stage of the game, when she's this fed. Smite off. Who killed the Irelia? I did. Okay, good. Nice. Nice. 
That's worth. Honestly, anytime we kill the Irelia, it's really easy to kill the rest of them. She's just a pain in the fucking ass to kill, because she has shield bow, endless healing, she's got steel caps, chain vest, she's four levels on me. Well, I guess three now. It's just, like, impossible to kill that champion. And with her passive, it's just, the healing is insane. Maybe I should get Bramble this game, or Executioners even. I think Bramble would probably be better. We have a pretty strong... We have a lot of damage, so I think... Well, he's got Bramble, so maybe we don't need it. Okay, yeah, Dragon is free here. They're all... I don't know where they're at, but... Oh yeah, they don't have vision here either. Don't have that kick actually worked. Yeah, also ulted off it. I just didn't see it. Wow, we're losing and they don't have our really? I mean we won, but barely. I feel like we should have hard won that. Okay, the three of us can kill. We definitely need my ult, though, I think. But I don't have it, so we'll just have to see. Actually, we have Hecarim. He's busted. Hecarim alone will probably solo this. No, run to me! Kill him! Oh my god! What, are, what was my team doing there? I was like by myself. Whatever. We got her. I was worth shut down? I was worth shut down? That's what the game's telling me? Alright. I was worth shut down apparently. Thankfully it doesn't matter. Our Yasuo and our Hecarim are going to carry. But it definitely frustrates me when I take deaths like that. Because there's no reason for me to die there. I really is just so cancer. Most broken champion in the game. I really, I really, players are like, well, she's not good in team fights. But like, first of all, that's not true. She is good in team fights. Yeah, you can focus her, but she can just split. She doesn't have to team fight. Like, if she gets that fed in lane. But this one chose to TP for no reason. So she's in team. She should just split. What's Baron? No, oh, just do it. Do it. Okay, fine. Fuck, my cues are so off. Double kill? Yeah. Okay, that worked. That's worked. We actually did it. We soloed them, bro. Alright, now, question is what do we want next? <sighs> what is recommended? Hydra? I guess Hydra wouldn't be bad. Just because we're doing well, we'll do it. We're actually able to, like, do damage this game. This guy's dead as fuck. I wouldn't even fucking contest, because now you're going to give up a thousand to him. Oh my god, what is he doing? Not worth, though, because you're going to all die now. If you can't kill Irelia, then we lose. But thankfully... Okay. He gets out, at least. Huh... We should have just Baroned earlier instead of trying to kill him. I mean, I did get a double off it, so it was good, but... Oh, they're just shoving, huh? That's... that's a good play. Fuck. Oh, 
Oh, this is stressful, man. I don't want to recall. is a good target. Oh, he jumped into it. Nice. Let's do it. There we go. If we're quick, we can get Dragon too. And that's GG. GG, my friends. We did it. Okay, they got the dragon. That doesn't matter, though. With, I think we can pretty much push to end here. Okay. Jesus, man. It really takes three fed people to handle her. That's unreal. I think we just win now. Ow, Ari hurts. Okay. Maybe I need MR. That did a lot of damage. Wow. That actually worked. That's big. We get the Rakan, he lived. Okay, whatever. Let's get out of here. Good job, team. Oh man, we're in fucking bronze elo. And the games are hard, man. I don't know if that's a testament to how bad I am or if that's a testament to how hard support is to play and carry or if that's just a testament to fucking smurf queue ruining fucking fresh unranked to or doing the unranked series because if you do too well you get thrown into smurf queue like my the game i played before this that i didn't record we were not playing against bronze players can put it that way I mean, at some point, this really is gonna have to, you know, stop trying to 3v1 if she wants to win. Okay, I got rank 3 alt. 34 second cooldown. Maybe ultimate hunter isn't the play. I feel like my alt isn't that important. Maybe I should go ravenous. honestly pull that if I had my ravenous hydra completed I would have definitely won for that let's see was well, anyone gonna step over this step in range of me here okay never mind I guess we're just gonna push top. We'll win it the old fashioned way. I 
don't know if that. Yeah, this is definitely. I'm definitely visible here. Wow. They did he just hit a did they all just hit a shroom? Damn, that was nice. Alright, GG boys. We got a dub. Alright, I'm very curious. So we started off 0-2. The first two games, I the first one I had a 4v5, I planned on recording, and the second game I didn't record. So this is the first game I record, like I said, we were 0-2, believe it or not, to start off the series, which is actually good, because maybe we won't get put in smurf queue then. We'll think we're an actual bronze player, or silver, or gold, or whatever the fuck it is. I think, I think everyone in this game is silver. I'll give it to Hacker. Let's see, let's check. One, I want to see damage. I want to see if I was doing a lot of damage or if I was just stealing kills. Well, I did damage. I did damage. We did we did the least on our team, but we were very close. Um, let's see, damage taken. Not bad. All right, we got 56 LP. Okay, so that's decent. Um, after our placements will tell us a lot more where MMR stands. But that is going to be the end of our first support to diamond series. This is going to be Lee Sin focused, but it's going to be Lee Sin and other champs. So, uh, yeah, this one was just Lee. Hopefully next game we play someone else, but it just depends. Thanks for watching, though. Leave a like, comment below, and I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.